Honorable Trin. Honorable Deputy Speaker, the ACDP agrees with most South Africans in stating that the recent fuel hikes could not have come at a worst time. Taking the price to just under 25 rand per litre for inland users and around 25, 24 rand per litre along the coast. South Africans are struggling under the weight of 46% unemployment on the expanded definition, rolling blackouts, business closures from harsh lock from the harsh lockdown and irrational COVID regulations, flooding, drought, and collapsing service delivery. Honorable Deputy Speaker, any rational thinking person will conclude that the majority of South Africans just cannot afford to pay for these increases in the fuel levy. With the global price of oil currently sitting at over $120 per barrel and the rand weakening at 16 rand 11 to the dollar, our currency has been vulnerable to the bouts of weakness due to the strengthening of the dollar. As a net importer of crude oil, this paints a grim picture for not only South African motorists, but the general public at large. The ACDP agrees with the economists that every aspect of our economy, including consumers and businesses alike, will be hard hit by the fuel hikes. The impact will be severe and will have a ripple effect further down the economy on a macro level in terms of inflation. Transporters of goods and passengers cannot absorb the increased uh, costs of fuel as this will put them out of business. The reality is that these increased costs will be transferred to the public. We must do away with what economists call price stickiness, even though we are price takers when it comes to oil. We must rid this government and its department of corruption, fraud, inefficiencies, and jobs for cadres. For in so doing, there will be sufficient reserves to cover these exorbitant fuel levies. levies. While welcoming the reduction in the fuel levy, where with the extension 150 will be taken off the general fuel levy in June and will then be halved to 75 cents per litre in July, the ACDP adds its voice to those of concerned South Africans calling for the scrapping of the fuel levy and furthermore calls on African countries rich in oil to sell their Af to sell to the African counterparts at a price which will ensure that the African economies will not collapse. The ACDP cares, and only the uncaring will continue to inflict hardships on the poorest of the poor by these exorbitant fuel levies. Thank you, Speaker. Deputy Speaker.